Hey everyone, Demetri here wanting to give you a formal update on what's going on with the channel, as I'm sure a lot of you are curious to know, where are the regular videos? So I've been doing a lot of impression videos recently, and I did a poll asking, do you enjoy them? And the general consensus was yes they're enjoyable, but belong on mini Meech, which is what I expected. So from now on, most of the shorts, I would say a good 99% of them, unless I find something that'd be absolutely hilarious, will go on the mini Meech channel. Stuff that's silly, ad lib, stuff like that. Now on to the regular videos. There's a reason you subscribe to the channel, mainly because of the Mario and Nintendo stuff, the in-depth videos like Mario Kart Origins, or maybe even the rant videos and stuff like that. But the point is, those videos are in-depth, go in great detail, and have a bit of humor to them, which is why a lot of you subscribed. And I'm gonna be honest with you guys about what's going on with those videos. Yes, regular content is definitely coming. It's just been a busy past few weeks, you know, went on vacation one week, had finals, but now everything's getting back to normal so it should be good. Now what about Nintendo content? After all, I'm supposed to be a Nintendo YouTuber, right? Well, I gotta be brutally honest with you guys. I really hate what Nintendo is doing now. Now don't get me wrong, I love Nintendo games and will still play them, but it's like, what Nintendo is doing now, especially like with the Skyward Sword HD situation, they lock content behind a $25 Amiibo, yes $25, despite Amiibos retailing for $17, that is absolutely insane, and it really just upsets me, and whenever I hear about Nintendo now, it's usually bad news. Of course we had the disastrous moments last year like shutting down the Big House tournament, the Joy-Con thing, things like that. You know, they're releasing games unfinished and finishing it later with free content updates. And I know there are games coming, but it's just like, I don't really feel excited for any of the new games coming. Mario Golf, okay, that could be cool, but I'm worried they're going to do the same thing they did with Mario Tennis Aces. You know, launch the game with a little bit of content, then patch it up later, and by then, I'll lose interest in it. The only games I'm really into now are Game Builder Garage, and maybe Metopia, and that was a 3DS game. This could all change though. We can rejoice one day at E3 when we get a new Donkey Kong, we see Mario Kart 9, maybe Mario Odyssey 2. If Nintendo brings more games to the table that I'm interested in, that'll be all fine and dandy. But for now, all I'm really excited for is like I said, Game Builder Garage, you know, Metopia seems cool. I like the Pokemon stuff like Legends Arceus, I think there's potential in that. But just Nintendo right now? They feel very off-brand, they're doing a bunch of shady stuff that they usually wouldn't have done before. Like, I get it, Nintendo isn't a perfect company. They've done things before that were pretty stupid if you ask me. The Mario All-Stars 25th Anniversary Edition for the Wii in 2010. Yeah, that wasn't a very smart move. Pricing the 3DS at $250, yeah, that wasn't a smart move either. But that is just peanuts compared to what's going on now. It's event after event. Like I said, Skyward Sword HD, they're charging $60 for a Dolphin-style upscale Wii port. They're locking a major feature behind Amiibo. It just really breaks my heart seeing one of my favorite companies go down a dark road, which is why Nintendo really hasn't interested me recently. Because like I said before, when I hear news about Nintendo, it usually isn't good. But what about content that's coming? Well, I got good news for you. Rant videos are definitely coming. I finished the audio for the spin-offs rant and the retro gaming rant, and the college rant should be coming very soon. I also have another origin series planned, and with Mario 3D Origins, you know, I'm gonna put that on hiatus, because 3D Mario's been talked about to death, that doesn't mean it's cancelled, but for this new origin series, I have better ideas, and let me tell you, it's gonna be more fun than a barrel of monkeys. So anyways guys, this has been a formal update, I hope you understand what's going on, you know, I really hope Nintendo improves. My interest could get regained if E3 is good, but you know, just... It's very difficult to be into Nintendo right now, I'll just say that as a Nintendo fan. You'll see this with other fans too. Captain Alex used to be a big Nintendo fan, and now he has in his Twitter bio, not affiliated with Nintendo. So that should give you an idea of how a lot of fans are feeling. So fans will turn on Nintendo if they continue these anti-consumer practices. Well, anyways, guys, I hope you have a great day or night, afternoon, wherever you are. And as always, keep calm and da-da on.